If you own an agency or an online business, you've definitely created and sent invoices before. Now, manually inputting all the data on the invoices can seriously suck, especially if you have to do it every single month because you have clients on retainer and on recurring um, payment schedules. So having to make that same invoice over and over again can be terrible. On top of having to try and chase down the payments for those as well can really be a pain. So what I'm going to show you guys how to do is how to create an invoice automation system using Zero and Stripe. Shouldn't be a very long video. I'll just jump right in and show you exactly how to do it. So this is especially powerful if you have clients on retainer that pay you every month or every quarter. So some of the benefits of this invoice automation, you're going to save some time, you know, eliminate some of those manual data entry and repetitive tasks. You're going to reduce the risk of some human error, making sure that everything is going out exactly how it's supposed to every single time. And then you're going to get faster payments that they're going to pay you automatically and the invoices are going to go out automatically. So first off, how do we do this? We're going to integrate Stripe and Zero first. So Zero is the accounting powerhouse. So if you don't know what Zero is, it's incredibly similar to QuickBooks. It's just a different software, but functionally, um, it does the same thing. It's just the one that we prefer at my accounting firm. And then Stripe is the payment gateway. That's how we're actually going to collect the payment. So how to integrate Stripe into Zero? So first, you need to go and make a Stripe account, but you also need to create or log into your Zero account. And then from there, you're going to go into Settings. So you do this by clicking your business's name at the top left of the dashboard. So that's Sledge Accounting right here. You click that, you get this drop down, and then you click Settings right here. And then from there, what you're going to do is you're going to click Payment Services under Features right here. That's where you're going to click Next. And then from there, you're going to connect your Stripe account. Mine looks like this because I already have it connected. But this is where you will connect the Stripe account that you have created to your Zero account. Boom. Now it's integrated. So now how do we actually automate the invoicing in Zero using Stripe? So first what we're going to do is you're going to click the business tab and then you're going to click invoices once you get the drop down to come. Then from there, what you want to do is click on this new invoice drop down and then you're going to click new repeating invoice. And then from there, you're just going to add the invoice details. So what's input here is what will be sent out to your clients. So this is what it looks like when you go to create the invoice. So repeat this transaction every one month. That means that it'll go out every single month. Right now, how it's set to September 19th, that means that this invoice would go out every month. That means that it will go out every single month on the 19th if you did it every one month. And then in here, you have those placeholders where you can have it say month, so it'll say September, and then just put in the description, you know, accounting services, marketing services, whatever. And then you just do quantity one, whatever the unit price is for. And then for the account right here, you want to make sure that that's going to whichever account in your accounting software you're putting all your sales towards. So it's usually sales or service revenue. And then from there, we want to approve for sending and offer auto pay. So marking approve for sending means that the invoice will populate in zero as well as it will be emailed to your client. Marking this will also generate the offer auto pay box. So I'll show you what I'm talking about. So right here, this part of the invoice, when you, we want to click approve for sending, okay, like I said, that's going to generate the invoice in zero, and it's also going to email it to the client. And then from there, once you click this, this auto pay will pop up where you can offer auto pay. You want to click that box. And by doing this, when that invoice hits your client's um, email, they'll have the opportunity to opt into auto pay, meaning that they will get the invoice automatically, and then they will pay it automatically. You want to click this save button right here after you do that once you click save this is the pop-up that comes up and it's really just asking you you know what do you want to say in your email um, and you can template this in um, the zero settings as well you do want to click the send me a copy that way you can ensure that the invoice actually was emailed to your client and for some reason if you click that box and press done and press send it doesn't actually email you a copy that means it didn't get emailed to your client um, I've had that happen a couple times. Really, you just need to go back into your invoices, find that invoice, click it, and there'll be a little button that says email and press it again, and it'll send out an email. So what this means is if they opt into auto pay, the invoice will be sent out automatically. They will pay you on the due date of the invoice automatically. And then when the money hits your bank account, it'll automatically match the payment with the invoice that was created in zero, which is really awesome. It kind of automates part of your bookkeeping too. So this is what it looks like when it automatically hits your bank account. It'll just match it with the invoice. And then the bonus, 
you know, you can configure invoice templates in the zero settings as well. In invoice settings right here, you can create, you know, branding and themes and get your logo on there and some of that other stuff and kind of template out that email. But that's really it. If the invoice will go out every month automatically. It will pay you every month automatically and it'll reconcile in your accounting software automatically. So that is how you do it. Maintenance troubleshooting, you just really, I mean, at least every few months check to make sure that the number is right and that it's actually being sent out. I haven't had it break on me at all, but just make sure you're checking it. You know, by implementing this stuff, you're gonna save time, you're gonna improve accuracy and you're gonna accelerate payments. We know those accounts receivables aren't gonna be outstanding for nearly as long. So take advantage of these awesome tools. This is exactly what we do for online business owners. So if you want us to just execute all of this for you, you can definitely book a time on our calendar. And I'm gonna link this document in the description. So if you want us to do this for you, or if you have any questions further on how to do this, just click the document and you can go in and book a time on my calendar and I'll help you out. So there you go. That's how you create an invoice automation system using Stripe and Zero.